Hello everyone and welcome to our new Twin Motion video. In this video, I want to show you the moving object inside the Twin Motion. Let's go in our scene. Okay. From where can we create the moving objects? Of course, from context menu. We choose paths, and here we have character paths, car paths, bicycle paths, and custom paths. Before we starting uh, this process, of course, it's necessary to hide heavy object like this tree. I just select this tree and press on I button. And now my scene is light. We wait auto saving. Okay. I move my camera up. Okay, let's create first one character paths. We pick this uh, character paths tool and put start point. When I press with right button on my mouse, I create the dots. This dots is way. Okay. Here, here, and here. When I press escape button, now you can see the results. Here we have a couple of uh, options. We, we can change the style on these people. You can change the plotting. Let's leave to each. Of course, we can we can change the size on these pads, density. When we go up on this pro percent, we have a more density in this street. Let's leave this one to 10%. We can reverse this path and switch on and off walk. Okay, perfect. Let's see another one, the car paths. Again, we pick a star point. And when we go to endpoint, press escape button. Okay, let's see the disk control options. We can change the line or two line. We can change the line offset between these two lines, density and speed. Let's change speed to 20 kilometers. And of course, we can reverse the path. Okay, perfect. Bicycle path. Bicycle path is uh, almost the same like uh, the car paths. When we press 
Well, bicycle. Pick the start point. And end point. We can control the lines, offset, density, the put uh, density to 5% and put speed to 5 kilometers. Okay. We're almost done. Let's see the custom path. Here we can assign any object. We wait out saving, press start point. And endpoint. Okay, we have a preview model here on this tab, and we can control the animation once, whoop, whoop, ping pong, once, ping pong, speed, reverse. Rotation daily fall on and fall off. This is for the physic. Okay, let's see how can we change this object. Let's go this folder cars and when we drag any of this model we can see the result okay perfect The next thing which I want to show you is this, this animation object in a twin motion. When we go to characters, we can put animated human like this part here. Let's open animated human folder and drag with model any of uh, these people. Okay, let's see the control here. We can control the, the color of the quotes, pose, speaking, seating, dancing, walking. Let's leave speaking and see the animation options. We can change three different view, three different presets. Let's put another people and make the same speaking options. It's very easy. We can put a group people like these kids when we drag this in our scene. 
this one give us some more more details and bring our scene to life We can put uh, some cars here to garage. Okay. Let's put more animated people here. With the boss uh, seating and rotate this object and move close to this beautiful 3D model and also here we have animated animals Let's see how it works. When we drag this in our scene, we have a very fast preview. And also we can control the pivot point and put more bursts. Okay, let's switch on our tree and see how it looks seen from inside. Beautiful. The last thing which I want to show you in this video is section tool. You can find this tool here from a tools folder, sections, and create section cube. When we drag this section cube in our scene, We can slice every object in our scene. Let's see how it works. From this menu, I will select the section. And here I have control point. I can change the size of this box and when I move it in my scene I can slice any of this geometry. Here I can switch on and off this section I can control the thickness and thickness core also I can invert selections 
when I press invert, I can see the object only inside this section box. Now it's not necessary to hide every object in our scene to show one part from our whole project. Now we can create the section cube and this one is very easy in twin motion. In the next video I will show you how can we create the render and also how can you create the animation and export it. Thank you very much.